The overall goal of this procedure is to develop an agrobacterium-mediated virus-induced gene silencing assay in cotton to study gene function. This is accomplished by first growing cotton seedlings to the 10 days to two week old stage. Then, the cotton chloroplastos alterados 1 gene is cloned into a tobacco rattle virus based VIGS vector. The third step is to prepare agrobacterium cultures containing PTRV RNA1 and PTRV GRCLA1. The final step is to hand inoculate the agrobacterium cultures into cotton cotyledons. Ultimately, results can be shown for gene silencing by observing the albino phenotype on the true leaves of cotton plants about two weeks later. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods like transformation is that VIGS provides a rapid and efficient platform for gene function study in cotton. Though this method can prove to be a powerful tool for rapid large-scale analysis of gene function at the genome-wide level in cotton, it can also be applied to other important crop species. Generally, individuals new to this method will struggle because it is difficult to hand inoculate the agrobacterium cultures in cotton cotyledons. This method can help answer key questions in the cotton genetics and genomics field, such as exploring gene functions. To grow cotton seedlings for virus-induced gene silencing, add Metro Mix 700 to several 7cm pots and place the filled pots into a tray. Next, plant the seeds of several upland cotton varieties such as Fibermax 832, Phytogen 425RF, Phytogen 480WR and Delta Pine 9.